dear students a very warm welcome to you all here i am today with a very beautiful poem now you all know that uh, in this world everyone is selfish isn't it but after reading this poem definitely your mind state will change so let's begin with the beautiful poem nine gold medals now when i say gold medals what do you remember sports is it it i think you must be remembering your annual sports how do you you enjoy your sports every year isn't it that three days are full of enthusiasm and enjoyment right so let's see what is given in this poem nine gold medals written by david roth now whenever we participate in any event any sports what is our aim behind it to win right yes of course we play to win and we give our best to win the game so here also the poem is about nine athletes who give their best to win the medals now see when you play on the school level you work so hard for it right but this is the olympics so you must be knowing how difficult it is and how hard the athletes have to work how hard they have to practice so you must imagine what practice they must be doing right now this poem is uh, written by an american poet david roth this poem is very inspirational poem it in inspires a uh, human compassion and cooperation this poem is based on a story about nine differently abled athletes this uh, poem is uh, written in the form of a song and uh, david roth is very famous for writing songs so this poem is also in the form of a song um, have you ever heard about the term special olympics uh, let me tell you what is special olympics The Special Olympics is an international organization created uh, to help the people with intellectual disabilities uh, to develop self confidence, social skill, and a sense of personal accomplishment. It is con conducted alternating two years between summer and winter so let us talk about empathy first now what is empathy empathy is really the opposite of spiritual meanness it is the capacity to understand that every war is both won and lost and that someone's pain is as meaningful as your own so this is the quotation i will i will explain it to you later on now let's read the first stanza of the poem nine gold medals the athletes had come from all over the country to run for the gold for the silver and bronze many weeks and months of training all coming down to these games now in the 
this first stanza, the athletes had come from all over the country to run for the gold, for the silver and bronze. The athletes, they have come from many countries to participate in the Olympics. Um, they have come from all over the world. These athletes, they were there to compete for the race. Now, whenever, if you remember your annual sports, so you participate and give your best so that you can win the prizes, isn't it? Similarly, these athletes also have come there to win the medals like gold, silver and bronze. So they wanted to give their best and to win the medals. Many weeks and months of training all coming down to these games. Now, they have been rigorously trained for many weeks and months to participate in this event because you know that Olympic is uh, such a great event and to participate one must go through a rigorous training, a hard training. So all these athletes have gone through rigorous training for months to participate in this Olympics and they also have a great hope of winning the medals. Next stanza, the spectators gathered around the old field to cheer on all the young women and men. The final event of the day was approaching, excitement grew high to begin. Now spectator means audience, one who comes to watch the game. One who don't participate, just they come to watch. They are called as spectators. So a large audience was present there to see the event and also to cheer the participants. So this audience, uh, they cheered and enjoyed the game throughout the day. The final event of the day was approaching, excitement grew high to begin. Now it was the final event of the day. Everyone was eagerly waiting for this event. The final event was the race and all the people were eagerly waiting for this event to begin. The blocks were all lined up for those who would use them. The hundred yard dash and the race to be run. These were nine resolved athletes in back of the straight line, poised for the sound of the gun. Now the blocks were lined up. Blocks means here, the blocks uh, which are kept at the starting line against which the runners push their feet and begin the race. So all the blocks were lined up, they were placed in a line. The 100 yard dash and the race to be run. Now this was the 100 yard dash race. There were 9 resort athletes in back of the starting line, pistol for the sound of the gun. Uh, there were nine participants. They all were determined to run the race, to win the competition. And they all lined up behind the starting point. All these participants were ready and just they were waiting for the signal to start the race. Pistol for the sound of the gun. So these nine result or determined athletes were ready waiting for the signal. As you know uh, in your school sports to begin the race uh, the whistle is blown. right? So now here the signal was given the pistol exploded and so did the runners all charging ahead. 
but the smallest among them he stumbled and staggered and fell to the asphalt instead the signal was given the pistol exploded now the pistol exploded uh, giving the signal to start the race and so did the runners all charging ahead so all the runners charged ahead along their respective tracks they started running ahead along their respective tracks but the smallest among them he stumbled and staggered and fell to the asphalt instead the smallest athlete among them he stumbled and staggered stumbled hit the foot against something when he began to run and almost he fell so the smallest athlete among them hit his foot against something and he was almost about to fall down staggered means to lose balance as his uh, foot is hit against something he lost his balance and he fell down on the ground and fell on the asphalt instead asphalt means a black tarred road which is uh, used specially for running the race so he fell down on the road on the asphalt so what happened next uh, we'll see in our next video till then be at home be safe thank you